Oh, I'm ready for this. I'm excited to get my mouth on the mic. And already we've seen a bullet into the head of Poison. That's going to hurt. USP upgrade found. Aggression through middle. Config and Blame fancy the flank. And Rush has got an awful lot to do. But I see utility here as well, Lauren. They want to try and already mask the push-up for this plant. I don't know if there's anyone that can contest here. No, I think this is going to be a postured retake. But you do have that nice flank coming in. You highlighted it. And it's slowly creeping up the ramp. Dupree's going to spot it, get a fair bit of information. Does send a shot back, but he's dealt a fair bit of damage by now. Oh. Already, plan now comes in. Config needs a clean shot on this, then maybe opens up an avenue. Device is there, a little bit of a fade away. And Osafix gets Magisk, but by this point, you're down to two. Blame F. And now what, just NATO? one. He's uh, not really got much of a chance with this player behind him. Glaive tucked in, giving me vertigo on vertigo, looking down. Just trying to take this territory quite quickly. Not waiting out the utility. More than happy to duel. Device has gone down. Yeah, Device was a little bit further ahead. Estag couldn't quite navigate to the top end of ramp yet, but now he's going to slowly build up towards this. Now, Combi looks like he's actually on the ball today. Maybe feeling a little frustrated after that Na'Vi performance and just putting in the hours um, already comfortable enough. It is a 4v3. Glaive, though, down to 2 HP, does slightly hinder and hamper any of those potential upsets, but may just be a little bit further ahead. Now, Blame F is on an island, but it is quite a deadly one at that, maybe a bit tropical. But it looks like Majus is aware that someone's going to be around there. Tries to clear, but in the smoke he goes on the other side, waiting for everyone else to appear. Majus. Blame's playing this safe. He's around the pillar here, so oh, I don't know if the shadow nice. gave it away or simply just the angle. Well there played to Blame F to keep control on this. So now he's into a 1v2. Blame is now dead. Dupree's positioning cut right between them. I was a little worried for Glaive considering 2 HP is, is very fine margins. He's going for a deep smoke. I wonder what the intention is of that. You can see it does a bit of a... Oh, wow. Ooh, deep oh. bounce. And that's Poison's already taken down Device. That's bomb spotted. Glaive has to brave the gray screen and into the nade. Oh, that's colossal. This should be their first round on the board, unless Dupree and Magisk have got any tricks up their sleeve. NATO's getting inquisitive, but he does find Dupree. So this one starting to look like complexity's first. Damage is the name of the game here for Magus. Him being on low HP isn't going to make this an easy task whatsoever. But off on the other side, if he missed, there was always going to be a chance to punish. But Poison too good. Dupree's feeling a bit braver this time. He's going for a little bit of a wonder, but Rush is being patient. He's being yeah. cautious. He's waiting for NATO Safix to come back around, and suddenly they've reassembled this crossfire. The flash does nothing, but the guns might do oh, no. just a little more. Maybe not. Dupree, quick on the trigger, takes the side, but Poison's arrived. Yeah, he's another, and it's a hard shot to hit. Dupree's taken him off, and now suddenly Astralis have got room to move, room to breathe, and suddenly it's Blame F that's feeling the pressure. Config's hitting by... Hitten? That's being hit in the past tense. Hitten. Ah, hit. Hitten. Yes, thank you. But Dupree has to be the hero. Two entries onto that bomb site. Shots not landing for complexity. And this is what we want to paint on about this B bomb site. Neto is the stand in. It is the, you know, it's not that he's, uh, he's a serviceable individual, right? Oh. We're not going to detract anything from that. But in terms of being a little mechanical wizard like Oboe, he's uh, not that same kind of player. Obviously feeling like they're on an island. Russian NATO Safix have to pay some sort of attention to this. Flash in. Doesn't reach Glaive particularly, but does draw more of out. That does, though. Config waiting on the other side. Nice. Even feels good enough to go for the double. Kind of out and about in the middle of it all. But now the three remainders for Astralis have very little information as to where to play beyond this. I don't think they can afford to lose another one of these 3v5s on B. Flash is good. And that's the frag they needed. They spot device. Secret is out. We did a public vote to you see who was... You were horrible to me. To see who was going to Both of you ganging up on me. All I wanted was Alex to come back so there's at least, you know, someone... And from henceforth, I shall use that word. Into the side, though. A perfect flash, but they don't get him. Device has got the blind, but Nato's got the frag. Glaive finally claws one back. He wants more. Does have a smoke to deploy, oh. and he catches poison on the jiggle. Just like that, the round switches again. They flip the coin. Oh, and that's a bit of a sketchy one from Nato. He's in jeopardy now, and he needs to try and get out of dodge. They're not rushing this plant. And that was the chance. It's now squandered. Nato in a real spot of bother, and he's gone. Bloody hell, Glaive. A 9-6 half really is compulsory if they want to stay competitive. Here we are. Bloody hell, Glaive. Oh, rush. 
Yeah, real nice. Looks so easy. It is very clean, isn't it? It, it doesn't feel like complexity of putting up too much of a fight whatsoever. Astralis are ready for every single duel. It almost seems when we're on a player who's going for an entry, we had the S attack, three man up the A round. We had Dupree late round going into the B bomb site. This Glaive. is obviously much later down the track here, but Glaive is just walking on in. It is against pistols, but there's no fight really being putting up, put up from complexity here. He's done it against gun rounds too. All yeah. of them have. That's that's the scary part. You know, they're, they're absolute cads just getting away with it. Um, for now, five alive, no threats to be found. Blame's gonna be flashed in now. Good crash. Triple kill, that's a way to find at least an advantage. It may not be the round though, still 60 seconds on that clock. Where's the smokes? Okay, so there's one on device. They won't have the oh. luxury of both. Oh, and poison. Yeah, poison. Solid catch, oof. <laughs> they don't have to go A, there's 50 seconds left. And if they take down Rush, Oh dear, they know he's positioned now. Does Dupree want this? He's gonna walk straight through, is he? No, he's not as ras much of a rascal as I initially assumed. But he's got 40 seconds. If he just cuts noise, one of them's gonna have to rotate, but he's... Oh, that smoke, come on. Yeah, he sees him. Oh, and he misses the shot. Nato getting sketchy now. And Dupree has found Rush. It all falls to Nato. The stand-in has to step up. Oh, he was perfect as well. He's reading that crossfire perfectly, but this readjustment from Nato could still have some validity to it. That's enough for NATO to know it's a fake. Now he can start the push, surely. Yeah, closing the gap. Jiggle from Dupree. This is tough for the Dane. Both hailing from Denmark, in fact. NATO Safix is waiting, and Dupree knocks his head off his shoulders. A triple kill clutch. Of complexity. However, that bow, not oh. very strong as Dupree just absolutely dismantles two players over towards the B side off S attack's flash. That was a, a balsa wood bow. <laughs> that one did not hold. Oh dear. But perhaps from bow to bow, some respect could be gained if complexity finds out. Oh, he's just been caught out again. Dupree's on for the ace here. He's just behind enemy lines. He's under their skin like the scarabs from Scorpion King. You've been on the movie dives, haven't you? <laughs> Do you remember that one, though, where yeah, the scarabs are all under their sky? I yeah. freaked out. Freaked me out for a long time. 11-year-old me, very much. Yeah, the mummy freaked out. Multitudes of Here things. We go. Hold on, hold Watch on. This. Poison's this. kind of in a bit of a fool oh. here. You can see it happening, and now the 1v1 device is... Oh! <laughs> he doesn't have his life! I knew oh. it! Poison is a gangster. He holds his orb sideways. Forces forward from complexity. As the tag needs to slow them down. Nato's across, that's an important and integral component. A bomb plant is the next step. Astralis, they're prepared for this retake though. Look at the full util set, the boost gets already. Completely canceled, the nade Eight. landing on Rush's toes, the sprinkling of bullets doesn't quite catch him just yet. Not yet, so it is time to see that utility. You see already S tag. Looking to see where he can put that nade to good use. Could be towards sandbags, could be on towards ramp. Smoke bound to go through from Glaive. Flash to soon follow. And the kit will be by S attack. So keep your eyes on him. He'll be the final man that needs to be working towards that bomb. Protect the president. Right there. Rush is right there. Rush? Oh my god, he's sticking it. And he, I, I, I don't know how the hell that just happened. So many bodies coming out from behind that smoke. Nade ready to be put to plant, which Rush will receive. Ah, it does a fair whack of damage, but they still stand. Now they don't. Rush goes down. Nato Safik's going to find at least device. Now let's look at where we stand. A 3v3 post plant, but the HP for the CTs is quite low. So that Deagle does actually find a little bit more validity in what it can do here. So just in case you're wondering what I'm doing on Virgo tonight, it's sitting here and throwing that smoke every round. Yeah. Cool little retake, makes me feel good. Has oh. landed perfectly. Blame, however, catching another. This looks set for success. And I'm talking about complexity to change my mind is Magis. And he hasn't got the kit. You're absolutely bang on. Time is not on their side. A recovered AK for poison. He wants to hunt and survive a two birds, one stone situation. Nato should live here. Poison. Nice. He's like got his arms around the pole. It's like, it's actually kind of feasible. He just can't see. <laughs> <laughs> he's wrapped his arms around the pole, and he's ready to go, to dance, if you will. Lovely. Nice work. Device takes down Rush on the mid luck, and now Poison's going to walk into the impossible headshot angle. Uh, yeah, I hope this comes into fruition. I just want to see how dirty it is. You watch Poison's POV if he sweeps in. Why, actually, yeah, here we go. 
Oh, oh it's too many targets to work yeah. with. Stay away, device. Oh, oh. He tags oh, him. Tag and nothing more. Bloody hell. I don't love to see it. It's a little weird. Uh, the blame F looking for a couple of pixels in the smoke. Not going to find anything, but I think they've noted each other are there now. Blame. Oh, just put down in the end. It's config now left in a 1v5. He's blind. God. And he's dead. Yeah, config's had a bit of a rough game so far in terms of the opening duel statistics. I think coming out of the first half, he was sitting at 1 and 4. Not necessarily unscathed because oh. Magus is going to push forward. He's going to commit to this, and that's now the bomb. Slows down, hindered, swings back to check site. It's already overwhelmed. Yeah, but the bomb was exactly as you outlined, stuck. So timing could become a bit of a factor here. If they throw these incendiaries towards the plant spot now, Nato's holding it. He's going to just about get away with his life. Drops his own smoke and bullets. Everything brings him down to five. Oh, dear. The smoke's going to give them something to work with, though, Alex. The Stratus don't even need to drop their own right now. They have done. Is that sandbags, Molly? Yeah, it is. He's just working it out for himself. Bingo, bango. Not ideal. No one home. Nito okay. through the smoke. Oh, no. Doubled up on short. Clean. Needs another catch shot. It's Dupree that finds it. Two on one. And he finds it. Looking for the fourth. Config could save him. He's got enough time for the defuse. Has the kit and device. Will save the day for Astralis. A solid attempt. Have to give credit to Config for... Slowed for a second, Dupree this time on it. Molly comes in, forced away. Deeper angles now. They're, they're getting mid control. It's just what do they do with it? Oh, it was so fast, and they just run through the Molly. Dupree, he can't believe his luck. He collects three. Remaining two on towards the B site, but he can do it all. Let's get the ace. Let's finish on a bang. Let's finish loud. Already forced forward by the incendiary. Config tucked in on the gens. Dupree does find his fourth. One more for the ace to finish it all. Nato. The super sub has found himself one, but hey. Dupree completes it. The ace, it's not on the sleeve, it's in the server. And 16 to 6, the final score of our first map today. Speaking, just descending loudly. Smoke to main, this will be a top hit. Config, a lot of targets and hard shots to hit. Rush does find himself one and a clean kill into the second. Config's Ooh. popping heads. Rush has done the same, a double kill for both on the top side. Defense here. It's the perfect start to complexity CT half. Quite nice, wasn't it? It's nice. Lost for that. Big. Easy lockdown ben. there. Fast towards Yard with the bent elbow smoke. Owie. Flame's got himself access to secret. They can descend and now in a will require a rotate. Poor old NATO Safix has got himself an MP9. And a frag, oh. he says, with bated breath. Unfortunately, not converted. A chance for poison, but squandered now as utility will be deployed. It's a good incendiary, but cost him his life to deploy. Device has already denied all of that space on ramp as well. These CTs are just going to have to accept their fate here. Flirting with the idea. Oh! Uh, uh. Oh, Dupree just hops sponge. away, and now May just comes around. So, yeah, at least losing one there. I wonder if Config can do any better. Yeah, Glaive already softened up. Keeping control of this might be a bit trickier. Rush. Yo, what up, dude? Did you see the new Haikyuu comes out today? Oh. The new Haikyuu, really? Yeah, today. Is that an English dub? Uh, no. It's just subtitled, is it? Yeah. At this point, they have to start getting a move on. Blame needs a multi-kill from this position to lock down the top split. We saw this position working out quite well Ooh. not that long ago. Damage, sure. Kill, no. Nato Safix, though, set up postured to capitalize on any of that damage that came through. But now just poison left and that all incredibly valuable. Well, he should have. Yeah, he could have. <laughs> Poison's Gucci. He has hit the first. There is more to come, though. S-Attack likely going to have a chance. Oh, my goodness. He's going to survive another. It's the third that finds him. Dupree takes the AWP out of the hands of Complexity's AWP. Could save him here, but... Okay, that's really good. Gets the first. Maintains position. Now, S-Attack's going to have some freedom here and... Should be able to get a safe plant. Question mark. Yeah, no, he should be okay. The nade's going to come through, but now retake positioning. Zero kits on the CT side. Yeah, Magis is going to have to do a lot here, and he's already thrown out the nade. That's going to soften him up nicely. He does execute poison. Second, not so easy. Rush finding another. Molotov available. Nice attack and Dupree. Dupree's already caught one on that ramp ring. That's all falls to NATO. He does have that smoke, and he's going to deploy it now. Try and isolate these jewels, but he's being a bit lackadaisical about it. Dupree can jiggle. Smoke has failed. And that was his chance. Dupree just mocking him on the jiggle peaks. Dupree's looking sharp today. Wasted away. Nato to be challenged. Oh, and Esatag was so prepared for that. Blame, though, boosted up with his low HP, is enabled to find a 
equalizing frag. Flashes and oh. extending outside, standing in the open on main, finds another as they cross to look to descend. It's a two on three. Yeah, these type of rounds, they lost very handily on Vertigo. They need to win this one. Rush could get caught out here. It's unlikely. Dupree was not oh. ready for that. Oh. Chilling out. Oh. Just to clarify, by the way, for future commentary from that position Rush was in, am I calling it Mustang or does that make you uncomfortable? Uh, <laughs> um, what am I calling it? So that the I can't call rafters because it's so much. No, it's I, all rafters. I know, but Mustang, nobody's going to get. So what do we do? I do think you just call it the rafters. All of it. Oh. Yeah, like, okay. and then when we break it down, we can be a little bit more specific with the name. But okay. yeah, I, I don't think we could tease it. Nito Safix on quite the contrast. Tucked in on the stairs. His chance. He's got to get timing. That's it. It's perfect. Double. He'll take that. That's damage inflicted. A three on three, though. Magisk has clawed it back. Ooh. Poison falls on the top site. Dupree deploying his utility. This could be a bomb plant, but he hasn't got the help or the site. Config's still on decon side. Do they know the config's there? No. I'm not sure if he shot that much. Maybe he's let a couple of bullets go, oh. but it doesn't seem to matter. Mage is so clean, so crisp. S tag going to get pressure, maybe building towards ramp or wherever they feel like they could dive back up the vents if they so desire. Plenty of potential, but only 23 seconds to play with. So a little bit of a limit on how far they can take it. Flame gets caught. That's now ramp secured. They might scrap the vent idea, head right back around towards the site. Bomb plant should be coming in, and I don't see a way for Rush to find anywhere here. Uh, he was quite surprised that they picked it as well. Yeah, yeah, because... They're 10 and 2 on Nuke since returning from the player break. So they've looked very good on Nuke. And even though Astralis had five on the trot, uh, I guess they thought they could exploit some things over there against Rogue. I really want that rematch, right? Dupree can control that vent rotation. If they get down towards lower, they take NATO out. This round's open. He's, he's holding his ground. He did hold for one. Now, everything's been noted. Dupree's position now becomes very strong. He holds those rotations. He keeps them all absolutely oh, enamored no. by him. That's brilliant work from Dupree. Even a push coming through on ramp, but the timing's worked out well for him to tuck further forward. And now he even starts considering, well, where's Blame F in all of this? What's he been up to? And they just Whoa, miss each other. That was so close. Completely unannounced now. Blame, unfortunately, having to accept that this round is long gone. And he might even walk into Dupree again. Wow, great round. He really is looking very sharp today. Has he got a flash coming in from someone? Poison? Yeah, Config trying Conflict. to bait for him on contact. No one's got a flash. This will have to be dry, and they're already Ooh. falling towards top side. And Glaze spots him. Blame. His shoulder's just a little too visible. One too many days on the push, pull, legs. Not just pulling Astralis straight into the top side, and that's the poison. Quick flick, poison. Surely caught. Or rather, that's Magisk. Katuk's in now towards the squeaky side. s -attack clutch. Winnable. Very much an attainable goal here. And the wild spray does reveal his location as well as preparing poison. So they'll take it. A fifth. A necessary one. Pulled off a big one here on the cards. Four double digits on the T side. Flame F tucking on in towards the secret position. Config with the shotgun towards top of hut. Poison still with that AWP. Dupree's looking sharp. See what he can find at the top site. Config likely exposed here. I'm surprised he hasn't gone down. There we go. And up on the rafters is Rush. It's only a one for zero. Yeah, comms must be either really bad for complexity or Config didn't think they would come through. Nito very much alone in his push as well. Looks like 10. Catch. Oh. He does, down to 50. Oh, Glaive just baits him with the steps. Poison just in a dire situation. There's no way out. 10-5 on the half. We're going to grab a bottle of water. You should too. I think the gg.bet odds at the top of your screen there have just doubled since last time we yeah. checked on in. So, oh. Oh. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Free? One bullet. Poison's dead. Down the vent they go. The rotation coming on through. We can see right now. That's the tag. He's already post rolled up. Damage so done. Dink. Yeah. So this is looking okay right now. He's wanting to take more space. Oh, they're, they're quite vicious, these little tees, aren't they? Right in their faces. Here we are. It's a good start. And that's even all. better. Dupree has to clutch up. He started this with a fantastic one bang. And now Config's going to open that door into Dupree. And that's what they needed. The Dane finds a double. Well, we don't have the Molotovs to stop the rush, but it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. Over towards Yard, it's going to be the quick L block smokes coming on through. So Device is going to have his vision obscured immediately. But Glaive wants to fight. That's Whoa. a great nade. Yeah, that did a lot of damage, and it could be finished off. Blame ahead of the pack. Cost him his life, and Glaive so precise with a 5-7. This round has already come crumbling down for complexity. This was their round to win. He gets a kill here, and we'll call it round over. Yeah, one kill is all he needs.
They're going to boost for the peak. This is actually quite nice. Oh, but he still hits it, Dupree. What has he had in his breakfast bowl this morning? Oh, my. Oh, cracking stuff. Okay. Two rotations already. Magus is here. He's the big one. He's got the rifle. Does a fair wacky damage. Two decent portions of damage, but no kills to be garnered off the back device in the right place. Esther Tag even better, finding config. That's one of the low players. Now Blame F takes damage and he even gets killed by Glaive. Suddenly it's looking a bit deadly oh. and there's the nade. It's all falling to pieces. Yeah, this is getting disastrous. NATO wants something to do with device. The nade does look like nothing more than a delay oh. of the inevitable. They take it right back, double from Esther Tag. Uh, with these rounds being one last, one last, it's the money it hasn't had a chance to build. and. If this continues going in this fashion, Captain Obvious has entered the room. Astralis will be taking this one. Timeout will be called. They've just been swarming them here. They've been all over them. This oh. tag is there. Got a nice little molly. Flash. Oh, where did that bullet go? I don't know, but Config, his lands very well, cleanly. Talking. Yeah, now with 17 seconds, T-Side holding three alive. They are damaged, though. They are a little wounded in this, but let's see where they take that bomb. 10 seconds, they've got to go yeah, now. He's got the nade for the plant. It's not going to kill him, but it does get him close. Config catching device as well should translate now into a round. The work has been done. Duvi device tagging up one, leaves it for Dupree. Well, and as you can see, Esther Tag might have just enough money to go for a buy if they would like to do this once more. But as Astralis continue to force buy against Complexity... <sighs> Blame's done him. Tags him as well. That's yeah. going to be a real frustration one. Poison oh, actually finds Glaive. They're yeah, being gifted these. Trying to throw out the flash towards heaven. Indicating they might be heading back towards the top site. Blame still lingering in lobby as well. As the tag on the hunt could be a perfect position to handle this. He's got the info. He knows at least where. One. Oh my god, he oh. sticks it! Very nice shooting from Esatag, and now it should be easy for Blame to find the first. Don't forget, he's only got two, eight, make it three HP. And two kills. Three quickly up the ladder. And we'll finish things off. So we do see the 13th. Looks like an AWP recovery is on the card. Glaive versus Blame. It's been quite the battle over towards the yard side of the I map. Swear, I swear that smoke got stro gets dropped just because of the comms from Glaive, and now they can destroy. Config's done well. Solves that mystery with his frag onto Device, but it's still a numbers disadvantage for them to overcome. He's desperately trying to sell this lower fake, and at this point in time, it may not even be a fake. He's lost his teammate. Yeah, doubles back down. He wants to try and... Make something of this. If he was to get the bomb down now, we've got time for a reposition. And Config very, very much individually capable. He's opted to fake the door. Hunting Glaive. Timing is everything here. He gets found by one of the three. They're going to be so potent locking down positions like the vent, ah, rotations dude, to the Watch this. Esther Tag's about to line him up, knock him down. First found, bomb drop dark. Esther Tag with a flash and a few more. He's only going to get the second. He's done well to delay. Config, oh my goodness, he's gone unchecked. So if he gets his timing right, he could destabilize this retake. Oh, it, 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 felt, it felt naughty. And now Nader Safix and Poison. Yet to get that bomb down as well. And the problem is that there isn't a safe place to plant anymore. Nato Safix. Ooh, now that was quick. Has to die. Trying to. Please. <laughs> bring me to death. <laughs> Trying his hardest to die. Yeah, that's a funny one. It's one to make it stick. They've been able to pressure Us. ramp a fair amount. But yeah, the pacing is what I'm looking at. Config. You're looking at Rush with him, but Glaive is so ready, so is Magus. Two of those kind of more poignant pieces that we're trying to make to play just haven't happened now Dupree I think he knows that Blame was around but Blame's just off he's just holding W s has been given the warning Blame has the element of surprise and he goes all the way to ramp he really just wanted space he knew he'd lost the bomb he had to do something to have the element of surprise and a numbers disadvantage and so fair play to him now this mid round requires some prowess poison very quiet so far and I love watching this guy play can be very precise a demonstration provided 
two on three now. Was previously four blank hunting into Dupree, but he was so prepared, so ready. Device is ready to collect and finish this one off. A missed shot. Poison. AK versus Orc, Glaives and Spawn as well. This is madness. And finished off for 16 to 8. Astralis continue their lower bracket run here at ESL Pro League.